It's coloring party with friends time 2023. Oh yeah. So get ready, sit down with a cup of tea or soda or a cup of coffee and watch what everyone colored this week for coloring party with friends 2023. And let's go check out my awesome co-hostess. And here is my awesome friend, Crafting with Pat. Oh yeah, she is an awesome creator and she's always joining in and helping everyone with their channels. She is so helpful, so sweet, and she always has a big smile for us too. Now let's see what she's done lately. Of course, she's joining in with Coloring Party with Friends 2023, but she does join in with a lot of other friends, as you can see, and joins in with a lot of different channels. She is an awesome creator. Go check her out. But she doesn't just have this crafting channel. She's also got a gardening and channel. And here is Pat's gardening channel, and it's Patricia. Oh, my gosh. And uh, she have a lot of great gardening tips. Go check out her channel. If you like gardening, you will love her channel. She shares all her beautiful flowers with you and whatever she's growing at the time. Don't forget to go over and check out Patricia's channel. Another great creator. Well, here is my second co-hostess, Designing with Emma. Oh yeah, another sweet great creator you're going to love she always has something to share with us and you won't believe what she does let's look at a few of her wonderful things she does she does lots of different things on her channel like me except she does really a lot of really pretty displays she really knows how to decorate that coffee table she knows how to set a beautiful table for six or eight and she always has a beautiful display in the center of all of her tablescapes. Each place settings are always beautifully put together. And her coloring is always great too. She's always joining in with us every week. Go check her out. She's an awesome channel. Now, let's see what Grandma did this week. Sorry about all the noise, but you know, I live right in town and lots of homes are all around me. There's no good time to film a video. So we just have to get in here and shoot it. This here is one of my little coloring books that my granddaughter got me. And they're easy to do. They're all watercolors. And I'm gonna share the pages that I did today. So I hope you enjoy Coloring Party with Friends. This is a collab that anyone can join in. You can join in every Monday, once in a while, and you can put it up anytime you want. Just leave me a comment and say, oh, my video's up, go check it out. For I make sure I always go over and check out your videos and give you full watch and support for you putting up a wonderful coloring video with friends. We love coloring party with friends every Monday we do it and hope to see some more of you here joining in. Now let's see what Grandma colored today. Today I did four little pages out of this book. I found it much easier just to tear the pages out and color them. They are colored with watercolors as you can tell. The paper is pretty good quality. I'm still not really doing that good coloring with watercolors. I think you sort of have to do it and get the hang of it but I still am enjoying doing it. And these are small pages and they're pretty easy to do. Grandma's getting really tired, so she's looking for something easy peasy to do. So I hope you enjoy the four pages that I colored today. Now let's start. Now this is my koala bear. It does have a cute little koala bear. We have a little butterfly up here and some berries sprinkled around. And I did use some green and uh, the yellow and sort of the reddish color and a little bit of the blue. I also have some regular watercolors that I also use to have a little more variety on the colors. But the paints that there is on these little pages does work very good. I just wanted a different, more color. And they really, 
the brown really doesn't look brown when you see it on the page it's more like an orange and I wanted more of a brown color and that's why I also used it then we had the little unicorn here let's see if I can get it centered so you can see it a little better and this one I thought turned out sort of good like I said I still think I need to practice a little more on watercolors and uh, get better at it they still aren't quite as good as I would like but, you know, we just do the best we can. We're, this is a learning process. We're not artists, or at least I'm not an artist. And I just like messing with it and seeing what I can do and accomplish. So I thought that one turned out pretty nice too. And then I have my little bird here. And then we have little strawberries. If you can see them, little strawberries. And my little bird, and there's a little flower on the bird. And I thought it turned out pretty good also. Um, you know, I'm sure uh, in time I will get better at doing the watercolors. But, you know, we only can do what we can do. And this one, I just love the look of it. And this here is the little bunny looking up at the moon with wonderment. Oh, look at that bright, shiny thing in the sky and the beautiful stars. And this, of course, had red berries, too, and some flowers sprinkled around. And I really enjoyed coloring with the watercolors. And the, the, like I keep saying, the little squatches of color here, they do work really good on the paper. It's just that there's not very much variety. And I've been using my own watercolors, and that's what I've been doing. But I just wanted to share these with you. And here they all lined up to share what I colored this week. Four small pages, and next week we'll see what I get colored. I will be coloring in a different book. Uh, I'm done coloring in this book for a while. I like to switch off and do different books. That way I don't get bored, and we'll probably go back to the gel pens and maybe a little watercolor, and um, uh, who knows what I'll, what I'll maybe do. But anyway, next week it'll be a different book. I hope you enjoyed watching uh, these pages I've been coloring and this book that my granddaughter got me. It's super cute. The pages are small, and that's what I like best of all about it. They were easy to color. I could do, I don't know, I think I did a couple pages each day. They really were not difficult, and I didn't need to spend a lot of time. So thank you so much, everyone, for coming by for Coloring Party with Friends 2023. Don't forget, anyone can join in. Please leave me a comment letting me know you joined in. I want to make sure that I always go over and give you love and support for all the love and support you're giving me. I always love giving the same support back. So thank you, thank you so much, and I'm so glad you enjoyed what we had to share today. Please go check out all the channels that join in and give them love and support too they put a lot of time and effort into their coloring and we want to join in and give support back well thank you all so much for all your love see you next week for coloring party with friends 2023 and thank you all that come over every week just to look at the videos and watch we really appreciate you also. Thank you, thank you so much. And you know I try to always answer every comment that you give me.